Hello and welcome back to Push-Ups for PTSD. I'm looking to raise awareness for PTSD and mental health, as well as raise funds to donate to charities that help the previously aforementioned groups. So thank you for any like, view, comment, share, or subscribe that stems from these videos. I truly appreciate all you do to help me help others. Quick facts coming up. Fact. In 2019, there were an estimated 13.1 million adults aged 18 or older in the United States with a serious mental illness. This number represents 5.2% of all U.S. adults. The prevalence of serious mental illnesses was higher among women, 6.5%, than men, 3.9%. Young adults aged 18 to 25 years had a had the highest prevalence of serious mental illness at 8.6% compared to adults aged 26 to 49 years at 6.8% and aged 15 and older at 2.9%. The prevalence of serious mental illness was highest among the adults reporting two or more races, 9.3% in 2019. Among 13.1 million adults with serious mental illness, 8.6 million, or 65.5%, received mental health treatment in the past year. More women with SMI, 70.5%, received mental health treatment than men with SMI at 56.5%. The percentage of young adults aged 18 to 25 years with SMI who received mental health treatment, 56.4%, was lower than adults with the same conditions aged 26 to 49 years at 65.1% and 50 and over at 74.3%. More facts will be coming up shortly, but I want you to know that I'm here for you, and you're not alone. You're worthy and deserving of both love and respect, and you don't need to apologize for your illness. There is treatments available, so please seek help if you need it. And if you ever feel like life is too much for you right now, then turn to friends, families, professionals, or even random YouTubers for help. It's never too late to ask for help, and there's an abundance of people out there who are more than willing to do what they can for you. More facts. An estimated 49.5% of adolescents had any mental disorder. Of adolescents with a mental disorder, an estimated 22.2% had severe impairment. An estimated 18.1% of Americans have anxiety disorder. An estimated 6.9% of Americans live with major depression. An estimated 1.1% of Americans, about 2.4 million people, have schizophrenia. About 1.6% of the U.S. population suffers from borderline personality disorder. 5.8 million Americans are living with Alzheimer's, and that number is expected to rise. An estimated 10.2 million adult Americans have a co-occurring mental illness. This represents 50.5% of Americans with a substance abuse disorder. If you're looking to sponsor a day or week of push-ups, which benefits charities and helps with my own monthly costs, then you can find my email address to the channel's about section and we discuss things further through there. I hope you're all doing well. Take care of yourselves, stay safe, stay strong, and most importantly, thank you for surviving.